some of them and start off in the first half. George, you've already alluded to this. Chemist Williams taking the opening kickoff. This is a 99-yard return, and you folks can see some great moves along the way. Really do. A young freshman that we've been waiting to break open, and uh, we work really extremely hard in the kickoff return game. And a great run, great change of direction, and uh, very happy. Way to start off in the way game. Mm -hmm. Seven to nothing there. And Kevin Smith, of course, another big day. Many of you folks already know that he ran for 177 yards and a couple of scores. He did all of it in the first half. This is one of them, a 22-yard touchdown run, and that made it 14 to three. That's a very consistent football player. Uh, take a look at this pursuit. I mean, your, your defense was doing this most of the day, George. Well, they did, but they just third down and let this quarterback as pretty nifty make some plays. And, you know, uh, I think the big thing was we just got to sit back and make some plays when we have to make them on third down. That sack right there forced uh, what was a field goal for SMU, 21-13. Joe Burnett, a couple of interceptions on the day. And that, of course, was a big one that kept the Mustangs from adding another touchdown. It was Joe had two interceptions and a fumble recovery. Mm -hmm. And it wouldn't be a UCF victory without an 80-yard touchdown wow. run from Kevin. Yeah, I, and he should have, it looked, George, like he was going to get stopped in the backfield on that play. He felt the kid on his on his heels and cut to the right there. there. And, UCF allowed yeah, just seven crazy. points for the Mustangs in the second half. This is action from early in the third period, George. Justin Willis, the SMU quarterback, goes down. And boy, he got sandwiched on that hit pretty good, left the game and didn't come back. Yeah, he did. It was a good call. You know, he had moved uh, Darius Knoll to defensive end, and he gave us a little more juice outside. You folks are looking at uh, Philip Smith. He's a great story. He's the only player on the UCF team from the state of Texas, and he handled one drive all on his own, George. He really did. I thought he did a great job, and I was happy to see him get out there in front of his family and friends, and uh, he had a bunch of people there at the game. He caps it right there with a 10-yard touchdown run. He had 90 rush yards on the day. 49-13 was the score. Uh, here's another good defensive pursuit and a great pass breakup there by your fellows. It really was. That was Sharif Rashad coming across on that, so... This is fourth period action. SMU, <clears throat> excuse me, actually going for it on fourth and two. Travis Timmons, Orange Young team up for the 10-yard sack. Right. <clears throat> and UCF <clears throat> would not allow SMU to get back into Knights territory. Joe Burnett picks off his second pass, and 49-20 to 20 was the final there.